Pharytima posthuma has a complete and straight alimentary canal running along the entire length of body. Mouth and anus constitute its interior and posterior openings respectively. It is functionally regionated into various parts which are buccal chamber, pharynx, esophagus, gizzard, stomach and intestine. Semicircular mouth situated ventral to prostomium at the anterior end of peristomium leads into certain narrow protrusible buccal chamber extending up to middle of third segment. Its lining epithelium is thrown into longitudinal folds. Buccal chamber followed by a spacious pear-shaped muscular pharynx which extend up to the fourth segment. Its anterior end is marked by a nerve ring placed in a transverse groove between it and buccal chamber. Its cavity is somewhat dorsoventrally compressed due to the presence on its roof of a large glandular pharyngeal mass producing a salivary secretion. Lateral wall of pharynx are pressed inside forming a narrow horizontal shelf on either side. The two cells meet anteriorly and posteriorly thus dividing the pharyngeal cavity into a dorsal or salivary chamber and a ventral or conducting chamber. Salivary secretion contain mucus and proteolytic enzymes which are poured into the salivary chamber. Eosophagus or gullet is situated behind the pharynx. It is short, narrow, thin-walled tube. It extends up to the seventh segment. Eosophagus is adapted into a bulging, oval, hard and thick-walled muscular organ, the gizzard, situated in eighth segment. Its muscular wall consists of circular muscle fibers. It is internally lined by a tough cuticle. Gizzard is followed by a short narrow tube, the stomach, which extends from segments 9 to 14 with a sphincter at each end. Its walls are highly vascular and glandular and thrown into internal transverse fold. The intestine is next to stomach, which is a long, white and thin walled tube extending from 15th segment to the last. It has beaded appearance due to circular constrictions corresponding to septa. Its internal lining is ciliated, folded, vascular and glandular. Intestine is divisible into three parts. Number one, pre tiflosolar region number two tiflo solar region number three post tiflo solar region